Hello, I am Gepwin. Welcome back to Stardew Valley. Let's relax. I don't know what we're going to be up to today. I should start in here now because it's where the TV and everything is. Fortune teller. Ooh, skull. Very bad. Very, very bad. What do we have today? We got a uh, lobster. Gus wants a lobster. Fragments of the past. We need to gather 100 pieces of bone. Ooh, mmm. Mmm, mm, 100. I mean, we're probably going to have to hit the mines like every day. Every day to do the skeleton stuff. But I guess that's that's what we're signed up for. Hello, Leia. Window is inspiring. Yes. Yes, sure. The view from the window can be as inspiring as you like it to be. That's fun. All right, now give me my bait. I've got a lot of bait. I've got the gold can. I think that I'm getting an iridium can later, to, like tomorrow. This episode, I think we're getting the iridium can. I don't like that. I don't know what that game stop was. Something's up with my computer. Uh, okay, I've got corn and I've got other such things. Yeah, that's that's a description. I want to put some corn into the flower mabob. Nope. Okay, corn doesn't go in the flower mabob. I forgot. I guess you just get corn. I don't know what I was thinking. Wheat. Wheat goes in there. Wheat goes in the maker thingy. All right, let's just grab all of our chore stuff today. Let's uh, get some wood. I think all I have to do is go to the mines and try to... Um, ooh, iridium of both. Nice. Go to the mines, try to kill some skeletons. I do my best to collect bones. I think I also get bone fragments from the uh, poplarexes or whatever, the dinosaur things, but they are not guaranteed anywhere. Um, you can even you can go to the other mines, but you're not guaranteed to find the things even, so what's the point? Though I do need to go to the desert at some point and see if I can get that um, and duck mayo. There we go. There we go. I do have to go to the desert at some point and see if I can uh, remember to get or afford that uh, thing to make the desert totem. That's That could be a worthwhile trip just on its own. Get the desert totem. Also should probably at some point try to get a few more starfruit seeds. Um, I don't have the stuff from right now, but I could plant some in the... I need them for something, and I can't remember what, but I could plant some in the... Um, in the... Oh, what am I thinking of? I'm fit weird. I, I've been... was started feeling like tired and confused as soon as I started recording, and now I can't remember what it was I was trying to do. Oh well. Oh well. I swear I need star fruit for something. And I could uh, plant them in the greenhouse. Get some star fruit going. That's probably what I was thinking of. Okay, there's all of that. Um, that's pretty simple. Well, let's do a quick loop. Let's head down to... Yeah, let's head down to the forest. Get my... Come on, get my hardwood for the day, because I need to get a lot of that for the boat. Need to get a lot of that for the boat. Did upgrade the house. Said we should adopt a kid last episode, I'm pretty sure. So, one of those is probably coming soon. And overall, I just need to, like, keep collecting hardwood so we can repair the boat and get to the island and get to some more of the new stuff. And though a lot of this stuff is new for me, I've never completed the game before. I've never gotten to the end game, as it were. Calling stuff in a game like this the end game is just interesting. <laughs> I don't know, it's kind of fascinating the way this works out. Also, I've been thinking of branching out. I've got another series that I am currently working on. I need to finish some art and stuff for it before I can put it out. But I kept looking at, and maybe... Uh, yeah, this will be out well before then. People can tell me if you'd be interested in this, uh, just as something else to maybe put on the channel. Uh, that Story of Season Pioneers of Olive Town is coming out soon, and it looks really interesting. And I'm thinking I might do that as another series. Um, there's a couple things I was looking at, but I don't know if people, like, the only thing I'm iffy on is it's just, it's another farm game. It's Story of Seasons, which is what Harvest Moon turned into when uh, people who actually cared about it were making it. And it looks fascinating, but I don't want to just do, you know, m multiple, multiple farming game series running at the same time. If that wouldn't be interesting. I think that could be interesting. They're different games. They're different styles of game a bit, but 
Maybe, maybe not. I mean, this is this is still a fun series to do. I'll look into it. I mean, I might get it anyway, so if I get it, I'll probably do at least some series on it and see how people like it. I've got another thing going that's very, like, coming up as soon as I am done. As soon as I'm done uh, working out a few things, I've got another series that I'm making that will be very different and distinct from what I'm making now, which should be pretty fun for me anyway. All right, let's head to the mines. I think it's still level 70 to, yeah, level 70 and down is skeletons. So I guess we just work our way through here. Oh, hello, ghosty boy. Hello, ghosty ghost boy. Got you, thank you for the um, solar essence. I like that. There we go. How many bones, oh, this is like, gonna be difficult if these things are only giving like two bone fragments a piece. Killing 25, killing 50 of the things was difficult. Maybe there's a better way to get bone fragments. I should look this up just to see. I've got a few days on this though, right? I've got six days. Oh my god, three bone fragments so far. Gotta remember to make sure I drop all of these off. Ooh, prismatic shard though. Prismatic shard though. Ooh, nice. Nice. I need to drop these off at the museum as well. I, sh I should look up. Maybe there's a way more efficient way to get these than killing skeletons. And it's just not something I've thought of. I mean, could be. Could definitely be the case. Just no idea. Because that's one bone fragment. Oof. Seven so far, okay. Gotta see. It's very random. Um, maybe there's like a loot sword or something, like a ring I should be using that'll get me more loot. I don't know. This level doesn't look like it has any skeletons on it at all. Hmm. Hmm, there's gotta be a better way to do this. There's got to be a better way to do this. Bone shards must be somewhere else, and I didn't bother to look it up because I forgot until I was looking at the things I needed to do just now. At least we run through these pretty quickly. Like, there's not another place in the mines where there are skeletons. So, you know, that stinks a little bit, but at least you can run through these ten levels pretty quick. Kill all the skeletons, and that's it. And they don't do a lot of damage, neither. Oh, come on, you die. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Ah, I shouldn't have done the Bone Fragment one, because the last challenge was all about collecting... was all about killing skeletons, too. And now it's... Now I'm just repeating myself. I don't like doing that. That's not interesting. I have to do this mine thing every day while I just repeat myself. Eh on killing skeletons. Stop, stop, stop. How many ways can you talk about killing skeletons? It's pretty dull. I am getting set up. Um, when's this episode coming out? End of the month? So we might have already done our first thing. If you follow me on Twitter, you probably saw. Otherwise, maybe keep an eye out. I am going to be uh, participating in a D&D live stream thing with some people. A couple people I know. If you listen to the, uh, if you listen to my podcast... I'm doing it with Izix, who's my co-host on the podcast, and a few people that I uh, met for this game specifically. So I'm going to be participating in a D&D live stream thing. Uh, I'll point to links to that if anyone's interested. Should be kind of fun. I'm hoping it's fun and enjoyable and interesting. That's always the hope with these things. Uh, I haven't done anything except prep a character so far, so... Um, prep is a strong word come up with a general premise for a character generally just just overall eh. click click where is there we go is the skeleton to ten eh, let's just go through we've got one more level this is it this is the last level where skeletons appear we'll go through this last one see where we be see where we be at and see what we've gotten to, and if we think, obviously there's going to be some randomness. 18 for six days. 
I don't know if that's going to be enough. Zero. I'm not sure. We may have just enough time to get into town and drop these off at the museum. Maybe. Maybe, 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 maybe. Yeah, I can. Um, yeah, drop off some bones. So we're at 18 and 18. If I can get about 20 every day for five days, then we get 100. Though I don't know if I can. I don't know if that's a viable thing to be trying to do. Um, what did I, yeah, Gus. Gus, hello, Gus. My Gussy man. Pumpkin soup. I wanted to see if you have any recipes available. You do not. Thank you. I was looking for some espresso or maybe something. You know what I do need is a lot of coffee. That's 300. I can make my own coffee. I should make more of a coffee farm. Coffee's dead useful. Dead useful. Hello. Exercise important. It is. Exercise is important. Nephew Shane has been staying at my place. I know. I'm very good friends. Looking for a delicious artichoke. I do not have any artichoke. Sorry. No artichokes for you. No artichokes for me. No one has artichokes. At all. Artichokes do not exist. They are a um, myth. Artichokes are a myth. You heard it here first. A giant thistle that you can eat and is delicious? Who heard of such a thing? Where are we at? Where are we at with stuff? I think I need to see about getting some truffles. There we go. Truffle oil. Got all that. Sell some truffle oil. I still need to upgrade my... I'm gonna sell you, sell you. Got another prismatic shard, which is amazing. Three prismatic shards now. That's just great. Put all this away. Put some rocks away. I don't care that I don't have any mail. I need to move this assembly. I want to move this and I want to move my uh, stable down here somewhere so that I can get to my horse more easily in the morning. I was just thinking about how I really, really need to do that. How many iridium bars do I have? Two. Let's start making some more iridium. Start making some more iridium. Now, I'm getting myself set up to be able to make more money. But even right now, I'm not actually making all the money. Like, I should be... There we go. I should be making more coffee and I should just be using the coffee for speed boosts. I should be saving that, and I should have had that in the mines before. That would have possibly let me not have to use so many staircases, actually, if I was on speed boost the entire time. Maybe we wouldn't, we wouldn't have had to use so many staircases. I don't know. Also, we're going to clean up Grandpa's grave here. There we go. Because I do like having it over here, but I like the way it looks. But it's overgrown a bit. We decorated it, which is nice. I hope that's appreciated. There we go. I really need to get just a ton more stone. <laughs> I've got a lot of stone. I keep using a lot of stone, but we need to, like, remake so many of these pathways and things. Like, look at this. What do we got here? Stone floor, wood floor. I don't know. Maybe wood pathways with stone. Because there's the wood which I also need to redo all around the lakes with. But maybe I should do, like, brick floors. That's clay and stone. What if I redo it with some brick? How's that look? So let's, um... Let's replace. Really, I have to also get all of this. Oh my god. Yeah, I have to take all of this up and then... Oh, but look at the path. Oh, that's so nice. Oh, that's so nice. Don't suppose I can hoe up this? No. 
All right. It's, uh... Wow. All right, well, let's start with the main pathway here. See where we get to. <laughs> Use some brick. Get my walls rebuilt. Uh, hem in some of my areas here. Oof. Oof, I cannot believe how badly I've set up my pathways. There we go. Oh, nice brick. That's a nice texture. I like it way better. I never have time. I never give myself any time to, like, work on this. Work on the farm aesthetics. I need to get my farm aesthetics more figured out. I never wanted to have just an ugly farm. People have amazing farms. They look awesome. I do just a little bit of work on the farm aesthetic every day. There. Maybe I'll do something different over here. Maybe some hay or something. I think I can have hay floors. Alright, put this away. Stone fences, hardwood fences, wood path. Yeah, I need to take up... I want to go to bed so that I don't lose energy for tomorrow, but I need to take up this as well and make some wood... Wood's easy. I need to cut down a few more trees, so I should make some more wood path, too, so that I can build around this. This is just awful in here. All of this surrounding this frickin' uh, pond. It's horrible. I hate it. I thought it would look cool, these little wooden pathways. I thought it would look neat, but no, they are horrible. They're horrible, and I hate them, and I should feel bad about myself for ever thinking they would look nice. Yeah, 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 we're going to bed. We're going to bed. I'm gonna... George's birthday. I'm gonna put the the ancient fruit in the seed makers tomorrow morning, okay? Okay, sound good? Sound good. Didn't make much money. If I want to be able to afford any of the cool big things, I really need to get my production down a little better, because we've been hovering... Oh, my trash can's ready. We've been hovering around 300,000 for a while. But all the good stuff is in the millions. Like, the actual literal millions. And I'm making a lot... I'm making some high-priced stuff, but just not enough of it. Like... Well, you know, eggplants, selling off a bunch of eggplants, great. Like, filling my field with more... With more ancient fruit, also gonna be great. Getting myself set up for, like, big, big harvests of ancient fruit, which is super profitable. Especially when I turn it into wine, which I'm planning on doing. Like, it makes you wait longer for your profits, but it's way worth it. It's very worth it. And the honey, this honey sells for quite a bit, the fairy, fairy rose honey. Alright, let's sell that, the coffee bean. Let's sell a coffee bean. Yeah, I'm sure that'll go for a lot, the coffee bean. <laughs> now this makes sense that you do always have to be like, you know, getting more and more stuff. What happened? Did I sell the... What happened here? Did I sell the ancient seeds? Did I put the ancient seeds away? I had more ancient seeds. I think I sold some ancient seeds. Well, that was just dumb. That was just really absurdly stupid. <laughs> oh, well. See, this is where we can have, like, the wooden paths. This will, like, let me have a little spot to get over here. There we go. And, uh, no new truffles. Y'all are running out of grass. I don't love that. Gonna have to make you some more grass starter. And let's see, what do we got here? More wool, too. Got two wool. I feel so dumb! Oh, I feel so dumb now that I sold my iridium, my, like, ancient fruit seeds. I was just talking about how long it's going to take me to build up 
my uh, ancient fruit reserves. Oh well, my mayonnaise empire is going fairly well at the minute. The mayonnaise empire. <laughs> Not awful. Not awful. Let's check on the greenhouse again. Check on the greenhouse one more time. Yep, no actual fruit, but... Look, I can plant two more of these. Cause I'm not dumb, you're dumb. There we go. I need to get more hardwood, I need to go into town, pick up my trash can, and I need to try and get more... Thank you. I need to try and get more uh, skeleton bits. Skeleton bits and pieces. Wool, I should just sell. This wool I'm just gonna sell as an artisan good, and this I'm gonna put into my stuff I should keep around chest. Um, put, put away the fiber. Put away any additional stuff over here. Oh, come on, really? I've been doing so well. I'm gonna keep this egg in my inventory because I can make another void mayo when I get back from the woods. I want to keep... Was that a truffle noise? You gotta see. I want to keep my... I want to keep my axe. I'm, I'm torn on the axe. I want to keep keep collecting hardwood, but I would like to upgrade my axe to iridium. Maybe I'll just do that. Maybe I'll do this, go back, grab those five iridium that I need, and upgrade my danged axe. Because that's my last tool. That's the last tool I need that's not Iridium. I apologize, there's something going on with all the cars outside. They're too... out of nowhere, you know. I do my best. Come on, stop. Die. I do my absolute best to cut out street noise. <laughs> I feel like I do an okay job at getting rid of street noise, but... Sometimes you're just talking and moving around and not thinking about it, and then there's just a horn. A sudden tiny horn out of nowhere. And I hate it. It's the worst. It's awful. I can't. I can't. Can't, can't, can't. Now then, give me, give, give. Over here. Over here. Over here. And, um, yeah, let's go back. Let's grab the iridium. We'll see what's available. What am I saying? We'll see what's available. We'll see if uh, I can make... What I'm saying is I'm seeing if the mayonnaise is ready and then I can change it out. Because the mayonnaise seems to make fairly quickly. There is a truffle. Excellent. I would like that truffle. Ooh, two truffles. Yeah, give me the, give me the truffles. Thank you. Three truffles. Well done. Alright, close that gate. Yeah, close that gate. Give me... I can't believe I missed one, so we're going to make more Void Mayo. Void Mayo is the money maker. It is definitely where the profits lie. I th do think I need to extend this pathway. I liked the idea of having the entryway path be a little bit more rustic, but I hate it. The idea was solid, the execution is not. Um, okay, give me five Iridium bars, and we're gonna upgrade my axe, and it's gonna be the last thing we need to upgrade. And then we're gonna go to the mine, and we're gonna kill some Skellingtons, and then we're gonna hopefully head back to town in time to drop off the Skellingtons with, uh, at the museum. Iridium trash can, that's the last trash can upgrade. Upgrade tools, Iridium Axe. That's it. That's gonna be my last tool upgrade. And now I have the Iridium Trash Can, which for, for my purposes does very little. I almost never actually use the trash can, I keep forgetting about it, but... When I do need to use the trash can, I'll be able to use the trash can. That will be the most upgraded of trash cans. I didn't check how the spirits felt about me today, because it's functionally irrelevant. Because we're going to the mine to collect bone fragments, uh, regardless of how the spirits feel about it. Oh, come on. Go around. 
Go around. There you are. This is such, like... It reminds me of, like, classic dungeon diving. It's actually kind of cool. It's like you're just going to the dungeon for no reason to upgrade your tools to come back to the dungeon to upgrade your tools again. I'm actually kind of glad that they gave you some dumb quests. These are pretty dumb quests. They're, they're filler. They feel like dumb filler quests in some ways. It's like, go collect this many of an item. But it's fine because it just gives you a reason to interact with a part of the world you haven't in a while. Like, again, even though you you... At this point, by the time you get to this point of the game, you should have, like, done this a million times. Aha. Is, is this going to be bats? What's all this? Oh, yeah, it's going to be bats. That's not useful to me. Thank you. I already got bats. I've already got bats. There we go. I do want to, uh, you know, complete more of the of the uh, skeleton, not skeleton, the monster hunting. Never really gone into very much of the monster hunting, and I would like to. I also want a lot more money than I've got. I keep talking about that, but I need to just look, do like the more optimal crop things. I need to look up some of the people who are like min-maxing this game and making as much money as humanly possible. So that sounds fun. I like to just live my day, you know, get as much content out of a day as I can, do as many things as I can, have fun, make it entertaining for y'all. Let y'all follow me on this journey where I just sit and ramble for 40 minutes at a time, not really thinking about it. Eh, eh. Wow, that hurt. I mean, not really, but not, not in the like, ooh, that did a lot of damage. Just I didn't want to get hit by that slime, and I did. More hurt my feelings, possibly pride. A lot of uh, skeletons today. A lot of skeletons today. Okay, so there was the exit. Got a few. Thank you. Bone fragment, bone fragment, bone fragment. Bone fragment. Not bad. Not a bad haul today. Making some progress. Making some progress. Don't know how long this is going to take. This is all essentially random. How many bone fragments I get, how many skeletons I see, how many bone fragments I get from each skeleton. Very, very random. I don't even know if luck would, like, get me higher drops from... skeletons. Got you. Got you. Skeleton sword. I should. I wish I could break that down into bone fragments. Ooh, there's a weird, weird slime. Gotcha. Magnet ring. I already have a magnet ring. Well, an iridium ring, but an iridium band that does magnetism. It's better than your stupid magnet ring. Ooh. Monster Slayer complete, see Gil. Eight. Though it's six o'clock. Not gonna be able to see Gil. Alright, any skeletons here, last level. Not seeing any so far. Oh, there's one. There's two! I think I completed the slimes, though. Gotcha. Bone fragments. Alright, one more down and then we go up the elevator. And... There we go. Up to the surface. Thank you. I think... Ooh, 48! 48! That's pretty good. That was a good day. Um, from 18, that means we got 30 today. I'm pretty sure this closes. This is not open. This is open. What's this? Slime Charmer Ring prevents damage from slimes. Nice. So I got a thousand slimes. Excellent. Dust sprites? I'm still killing. Need a lot of those, though. Bummies are going to be difficult. Pepperexes are going to be difficult. Serpents you're going to get eventually. Haven't seen hide nor hair or whatever those are. 
But you know what? We're moving along. Okay, I did get 30 bone fragments. Be very careful, though, because we definitely need to save those and bring them to town tomorrow. If I was smart, I would say I need to make a chest. And I need to take that chest and put it over by the museum for a bit so that I make sure I keep track of stuff like this. Am I smart? No. No, we've established this many times. There's another truffle. More tru- whoa, outside. Look at that. Look at this. Wait, look at this, look at this, look at this, look at this. They spawned truffles outside the fence. We got lots of truffles. We got three more truffles, three additional truffles. So we're gonna have a lot of truffle oil for tomorrow. There we go. A lot of truffle oil tomorrow. All right, let's be careful. Truffle oil, void mayo. Pomegranates, I've got a lot of those. That's, that's that. Don't just willy-nilly put everything in the box because I need to hold on to these bone fragments as distinct from the other bone fragments. I mean, I don't have to have to, but it's um, slightly helpful. It's a way to think about, about things. Okay. Uh, there we go. There we go. I'm hoping that we can... I'm hoping that we can get more of these soon. I'm hoping some of those grow, is what I'm hoping. Um, I've got a lot, I've gotten a decent amount of wood. Where's my flooring? Just give me some like more wood floor. Give me like 20 wood floor. And we're going to at least go around the edge of this thing with my wood floor. Well, I need more wood floor, but you know, you get the idea. We're gonna go more around the edge of this. All right, wood floor, wood floor, wood floor. There's some weird stuff down here. Some weird stuff down here, geode crusher. That sounds, not, that would be nice. Bug steak, eh. Give me some brick, give me some wood floor. Another 20, you know. More. More wood floor. Brick you make fast. You make a lot of brick pretty quickly, don't you? Put it under the... I can't put it under the chest? Darn. That's a little silly that I can't put it under the chest, but what you gonna do? What you gonna do? That is a little weird that I can't put it under stuff. Alright, now let's start getting rid of some of this path. This horrible, horrible path. I like that I've got this other little stone bit here to stand on that denotes where my like work area is. See, that's working for me. But this entryway is horrible, and we're gonna replace all of it. Nope, that was a that was a wall. That was a wall. Once you put down the walls, you can't get them back. It's pretty silly. The walls are weird. All right. There. Keep the wall width more consistent. Or the path width. Sideways paths can be two and up and down paths are three. Doesn't make a lot of sense, but it seems to be what I've been doing. Okay, that's... Oh, is that the original pathway? I forgot. I really honestly forgot there was an original path in here. Wow. Let's get rid of that wall. Come on, all the way to the edge. There, that looks a lot better. Oh, these bricks. These bricks are a much better work thing to be working with. Okay, um, put away the bricks and that, and those. I've got a lot of stuff to try to sell tomorrow, but we'll work it out. I should have sold all that at the Adventurer's Guild while I was there. I completely forgot. Completely forgot. At least we got the, sh the Slime Charmer ring. That's a pretty good one. 
All right, how do we fare? We got a decent amount of truffle oil. All right, 17,000. We almost paid for the axe upgrade, which we should be getting in the next two days. I can't remember if we get that tomorrow or what. What is that noise? Weird noise, weather. It's gonna be windy tomorrow. I don't know, I feel like maybe it's rainy. Maybe that's that noise. Lots of weird noise today. Yeah, it is a little weird. That's Oh no, that noise is coming from the neighbor. <laughs> Never mind. Anyway, that's gonna do it for me today. I hope that you enjoyed. If you did, like, subscribe, do all those things. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you all are having a wonderful time and staying safe and all those things in these, you know, nowadays. And I hope that you had a good time. My name is Gepwin, and I will see you next episode.